Okay, we're gonna have some dinner here. We're keeping it lean. Got some salad, greens, tomato, black beans, and some salsa. We're keeping it lean, gluten free. Always eat your greens. Plenty of greens. Oh, and just feast. That's pretty good. You'd think people would stop there. Now I like I like this. This is uh what is this? West Bray Natural Vegetarian Organic Black Beans, non-GMO, USDA Organic, non-BPA lining. This is the, in the can. That's really sweet about this brand is non-BPA lining. Now, I'm not sponsored by West Bray Natural, uh, but these are my favorite canned beans to, to eat when I can't make my own beans. The best beans are going to be the beans that you, you make yourself. Well, you put some beans on there just like that big can of beans. Now, what I did is I went ahead and, and rinsed those really nice. Uh, this is a great salsa. This is a local salsa. Uh, this is Casa Sanchez Medium Salsa Roja. Uh, these guys, um, where are these guys out of? Uh, it's... Uh, Milbray, Milbray, California, really good, really good salsa left over from yesterday, put some salsa on there, just get it on there, get it on there, so this is what we, what we eat to stay lean in the evening time, and that's really good, okay, we got some Gluten-free, vegan spaghetti boiling here with some broccoli uh, from the store and squash from the garden. We'll drain that off. We're going to eat that. We're going to feast on that tonight. And then over here, there's some low-fat vegan spaghetti sauce. I have found uh, Francisco Rinaldi. Really good. I'm not sponsored by this brand. I'm not promoting it, but it's a great option um, for vegan, uh, all natural, gluten free, low in fat, and saturated fat, no preservatives. If you look at the ingredients on this, it is tomato puree, diced tomatoes, sugar, some soybean oil, salt, extra virgin olive oil, dried onions, basil, spices really good total fat 2.5 grams fat per serving so that's a great option for me and then well, I've been going gluten free this is Tinkinata pasta joy uh, brown rice pasta spaghetti style um, so I've, I've gone gluten free uh, over the last week so um, wheat free gluten free makes a nice al dente pasta that's what I'm cooking up right now and we'll probably have at least two plates, maybe three. Big plates. Um, I'm feeling a little undercarbed right now. So we're going to feast and enjoy our vegan gluten-free meal. Okay, we just got back from the firehouse and pretty undercarbed, even though I just ate all that pasta earlier. So what I like to do is keep around the house, I like to keep rice. This is uh, brown Calrose rice and quinoa. And I just make, you know, a ton of it. Put it right there, and then I can have it whatever I want. Uh, probably have some gluten-free uh, vegan teriyaki sauce with that. It'll heat that up and uh, build some build some glycogen for tomorrow. So we can be high carb, so we can live hard.
Cars have always come naturally to me. But names, I had to work in the memory. 